The Elder Scrolls is one of my favorite game series of all time. If you've been watching my channel at all, then I think that that's obvious. I'm somewhat of a scholar of more refined Elder Scrolls experiences, but I wanted to branch out a little bit. I, I think it's clear that The Elder Scrolls has been a hugely influential title for a lot of other games, so today we're starting by taking a look at one of those games that has clearly been influenced by The Elder Scrolls. Now this series isn't meant to trash on indie developers or make fun of people who tried attempting to emulate some of that Elder Scrolls magic, it's more so to appreciate the influence that The Elder Scrolls has had and check out some other lesser known titles and see how they play. Also, because if I only did Elder Scrolls videos, I probably would lose my mind, and I like to do first impressions on things. So welcome everybody to the first inaugural episode, new series, new series of bootleg Elder Scrolls. Today we're looking at Dark Messiah. It's a linear action game, came out about six or seven months after Oblivion did, so I don't think it would be fair to call this a ripoff or that they were directly going at Oblivion's throat when they made this game, but I think that the influence is clearly there, and I definitely think that this game is worth checking out. So far, dick in the music, not quite liking this guy's coke eyes that he's hitting me with, just he partied all night long. I'm so excited to get into this game. I'll go with hard. I'll go, go with a little challenge. Finally, Master after years Henry. of- Oh, well, I was reading that. In the room ahead, there's an altar with a spider. We'll need it to get to the Shantiri crystal. My voice will guide you. And have no fear. I'll be watching over you. Find the Shantry Crystal, obtain Spider Key. You know, I, I gotta admit, I really like the fact that they just kind of throw me into it. They didn't they didn't have to give me a really long cutscene, not like Daggerfall. Although I appreciate the Daggerfall intro. You know what this reminds me of? This, so, just right off the rip, this reminds me of uh, Jedi Knight, Jedi Outcast, if you ever played that game. Okay, just some nice easy puzzles, not too bad, not too bad. All right, what is this thing? Oh, hey, hey, <laughs> how you doing, man? Uh, nice to see you. Is this a weapon? See the planks around that pillar. What the hell was that they throwing look. animation? Oh, I can kick with F. Okay. It looks like you'll have to go up here in this light, <laughs> Okay. I love how he throws it. Just bleh. All right. We'll see how far we can throw this box. I can't see over it. I'm trying to like look higher on my screen, but it's not an option. Yeah. God damn! What a throw. I feel like I'm walking on ice skates. My footsteps are so loud. <laughs> Ah, screw you, box. Yeah, that's right. Oh, and fuck you, planks. Oh, there's something out there. If you see, see that guy? The road, that should help. Now that was cool. For as edgy as this setting is, and I'm usually not a fan of edgy settings, this is pretty damn cool. Adapt, overcome. Holy yeah, shit! Time to use your combat techniques as I taught you. You didn't teach me anything. You taught me stab and kick. Those are two skills I think I know on my own. I think I could handle this zombie myself. Ring it. Okay. All right. Hey, ooh, slow down. We're playing on hard difficulty here. Oh, ow. Yeah. I don't know. It is hard. Oh, this is awesome. We're no longer an Elder Scrolls channel. We're a we're a Dark Messiah channel. Oh, I have stamina. No, it's just Morrowind all over again. Oh God, I'm I'm really gonna die on level one. Why won't you die? <laughs> Why won't this guy die? Black guards here. I have to bring race into this, dude. Jesus, there's no way I'm gonna sneak in there with my footsteps this loud. Kick him over the edge. Be efficient, Sarah. Really? That's what I was gonna do. That's what I planned on doing. But now you've kind of spoiled it. Oh my God, this guy is literally deaf. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Looks like there's spikes right there. <sighs> <laughs> I missed it. Oh, there. <laughs> Kick him against the side. Oh, that whoa. should take care. Oh my god. Huh? Huh? No, you won't get me. No way. He got me. Oh, come here. Suck box. Yeah. <laughs> I like that dance move. Now he had some good dance moves. Hey, friend. Oh, God. Okay, I gotta keep moving. Can I barrel throw? Yes, I can. Oh, suck it. Why are these so much better than the actual sword? God, would you just get away from me? So I see what people mean when they say that this game, like, kicking is your primary weapon. <laughs> is he just gonna keep charging after me every time? God damn it, this guy's too strong. Ugh. We can't combat his techniques. 
<laughs> oh my god. I'll show you the next step in your education. Oh, education. I don't want to learn. Don't make me read. Don't give me exposition. Just give me baddies to kill. That's really all I'm concerned about. Why did it get so blurry? Usually the graphics in cutscene are better. These are terrible. But I mean, this game is what, 2006? I think this came up off either the year Oblivion did or before Oblivion. It's pretty damn good. Wizard named Menelag. Right now, he's looking for an artifact called the Skull of Shadows. Everything is so edgy. Skull of Shadows, the Spider of Evanescence, the Power Cord of Green Day. Give me a fucking break! Take it to Menelag and help him get the skull. I think you'll know what's expected of you next. No. What, to kill him? I got no clue what's expected of me, man. It's been pretty dull. We should go back to the city. He kind of sound like uh, uh, one of the Nords in Skyrim. I'm not even kidding. I think it might be the same voice actor. Oh, it's Solitude. This game totally ripped off Skyrim. Uh, I could teach this guy a thing or two about carrying barrels. Now, see, this is how I wish the gates in the Elder Scrolls were. We'll stable your horse for you if it pleases you, sir. Yes, please. Go uphill past the Golden Rivet and Sweet Dragon's Blood. What's that? Oh no! Don't do another cutscene. My game might crash. Is my horse okay? Oh my god, it's uh, the guy from the Fantastic Four. What's his name? The Thing? <laughs> okay, y'all, I was not expecting that. That was cool. What? Yo! <laughs> this is the existential threat you guys are facing? This makes everything in the Elder Scrolls seem weak. Alright, we just get like some Dramora and dragons. Oh my god. Go, go, go. Yo, this is awesome. Why are you helping me out, bro? I don't know who this guy is. But Jesus, he's a bro. This is way... Oh, I don't want to... I don't want to... Actually, yeah. All right, we'll carry this guy. I'm just bringing him along with me for no... Is that a... Is that a monster under there? Oh my god, there is. Okay, go out in there and be bait. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, I gotta get moving. Go. No. Did I save him or... Did I make it worse? Hey, 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 get off my friend. Get, get off my friend. Get, my kicks aren't effective, man. No, 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 you're good, man, you're good, you're good. See, look, look, you got him, dude. Hey, 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 wait, they, mission failed. You are now an enemy of Stonehelm. What? Mission fit. <laughs> How did I fail? Oh my God, and the game crashed. Don't make me redo this whole damn thing. I swear, I swear, I, I will get, I will get frustrated with your game. By all means, let him Oh, wait, that voice in my head is actually protecting me. Thank you, nice mystery voice in my head, lady. Usually voices in my head scare me, but, uh... Oh, I actually can... What if I just throw it at these guys? Oh, shit! Oh, no. <laughs> Damn it. What am I supposed to be shooting at here? Shoot the Cyclops. Oh, this guy. Why is it my job? I just showed up in town and you guys are tasking me with saving the town? Why did we have nobody on the ballista if it was just gonna take three shots to kill this guy? Okay, next level. Okay, this looks like a cool weapon to play with. Whoo! Whoo! I'm like a monk. What? This game is badass, man. But we're gonna go with the staff, because I feel like it'll be a funny weapon to bonk people with. I think this is a source game. I actually think this is just Half-Life. Oh, you must be the envoy. Here's our guest. I definitely did not just try to bonk her with my staff. She kind of bad, though. For 2006 sad. video game graphics, she's kind of bad. Oh, I'm trying to apply my skills, and you throw me into a blurry so cutscene. You're Sabbath. Good to see you, lad. Isn't what this the guy I started that? the game I with? Get, I trust you brought the Shantiri crystal. Of course you have. Good. I'll take that, my lad, for safekeeping. Sure. We see you with it. Careful as long as I get to there. sleep with your daughter, the then it's all good, dude. Don't dismiss Arantir too lightly. There are rumors that he might be the Dark Messiah. She said the title of the game. She said the title of the game. Oh, that was awesome. That was the best part. It reminds me of that scene in Breaking Bad where <laughs> where Walt looks at Skylar and goes, Skylar, you know me. I'm Breaking Bad. <laughs> Why? Dude, I just want to sleep with the, the, the daughter or whoever, whatever her name is. And then we got necromancers here. Oh, shit. You're oh, shit, back up. Back up, dude. Oh, I can actually, like, shoot him with fire. <laughs> I think I've set the entire palace on fire. 
Let's go, man. Come on. Look. Look, you have nothing to be afraid of. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what I'm going to do here. See him. What was that? Okay, that worked. That was successful. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. Oh, come on, bring it on, guys. You actually have to, like, be accurate. Shit, I'm gonna die. Run. Run. Box. Ugh, it's the most effective weapon in the game. Oh, I gotta kick him into the fire. That's the move. Back up. There we go. Oh, another one? God damn it, not another one of you guys. Okay, what's the objective again? Find a way into Menelag's house. Is this Menelag's house? Hey, is this the house I'm looking for? Answer me, dweeb. Come on. Fine. Fine, prick. Is this a puzzle of some sort? That I'm just too stupid to understand? Yeah, I don't think I don't think I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing here. I don't think I'm supposed to be writing this around. No, no, you're not going anywhere. All right, there we go. So the barrel actually should just be my primary weapon. The barrel is what works best. All right, we'll switch it up. We'll hit him with the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. What was that? No way, that worked. That was actually really cool. Come on. Shit, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. No what? Go make sure he was alone. That's the swing that killed me? I dare you to get up. <laughs> you have another barrel coming your way if you get up, man. I really suggest against getting up, dude. Right, we'll take out this guy from a distance with the shovel. We'll go sniper. Oh my god, we actually got him. Quick charge, we can't let this opportunity go to waste. That killed him? No way, we actually one-shot him from a distance with the shovel. I gotta keep this thing around. Why is this thing a one-hit kill machine? Suck sh Ugh, suck barrel. I'm getting kind of like locked into the gameplay of this. <laughs> I'm forgetting that I need to actually say things. So what in the hell am I looking for? Some kind of key out here? Some kind of secret entrance in Martha's Vineyard? Maybe in the water? Hey, do you have an answer, fish? I know you know where the entrance is, Nemo. I'm not fucking around this time. You thought the dentist's office was scary? <clears throat> Wait till you meet my stick. There we go. All right, I'm in. Oh, I'm smoking these guys. The stick of truth, baby. Why won't you die? This is a pretty fun game, though. I'm not going to lie. I've just been genuinely enjoying my time playing it. Come on. Come on. Bring it on. Gandalf the beast. One down. I just have to utilize the spikes and I can beat this game. Oh, hold on. I missed. I'm going to need you to. There we go. <laughs> I just need you to relocate for me. OK, screw you. Get in the fire. Oh shit, he does have a bow. Come here, you prick. It's such a prick weapon to use. Oh shit. Why is the guy with the bow and arrow so damn accurate? <gasps> no, it did not set me all the way back here. Get up, get up, get up. <laughs> Catch you later, dork. Come on. Oh, suck chair, it's WWE. No, put your bow away. Prick. Ah. These guys will not. Finally. God damn it, these guys would not die. I might have to think about getting rid of the staff, although it is pretty damn fun to just bonk them with it. It's Dobby. Shit, another bow and arrow. Move. God damn, this game is hard. What, the, what just killed him? Oh, man, I, sw <laughs> I, did, I didn't know that chandelier was in the way. Hey, why don't you come up here? Okay, that was cool. <laughs> that was awesome. I'm all in on this game now. No. Oh, man, this is tough. But this is actually a lot of fun. And I want to beat this mission. I will beat this mission. Gotta get him. Come on. No, oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> Boom. Get fucked, bro. Just need you to run across the middle. There we go. Oh. Oh my god, I need every room to have a giant chandelier that weighs 500 pounds. Finally. 
Oh my god. Jesus, that was an intense fight. It was a lot of fun. <laughs> but the chandelier is the MVP. He's covered in the guts of like nine different soldiers that I had to use him to kill. Just on time, he ends his watch. Thank you for your service, lad. What's that noise? He's out here making noise like he's magical or something. Don't get it twisted, you're just a chandelier. I love this game. He's still alive. There we go. Now, I'm still not 100% sure what I'm doing here. That's not a fault of the game. That's my fault for just being an idiot. Is this another secret area? Is this another awesome gamer zone? Prick. The fuck off my tower. Biatch. Full health potion. Scroll. Scroll. Scrolls. We got scrolls? We got scrolls in this game? I only know one kind of scrolls. It's not that. It's one of these two windows that I'm supposed to jump out of. I highly doubt that I'm supposed to jump out the window, but I'm going to, and we'll see what happens. Woo! Okay, I mean, as expected. I, I, I just like exploring, you know, options, options. I, I have to, right? All right, we'll try this one too. Okay, that that wasn't that far of a fall, and as the main character, I think there should be some discrepancy. That should be a survivable fall. It was like, what, 35 feet? Man, I could survive that. Sup, bitches? I'd say that that was pretty successful, wouldn't you guys? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. They're like Minecraft villagers. <laughs> they do nothing but grunt. Half the dialogue in this game is grunting. The voice actors had to look at the script and be like, uh, Gandalf the badass would like a word, bitch. If you kill Leana or Leana dies, your mission is a failure. Wait, who's Leana? Wait, is that my girl? Oh no, okay, okay, the stakes are officially high as f- <laughs> I'm surprised they don't hear my footsteps. Yo, 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 yo. No, they took the- hey, that's the- that's the main object of the game. Oh no, hey, look. Now it's just you and me. You know, I get it, he's dead, but I was frozen there and you didn't even pay attention to me. Wait, am I supposed to go chase them? Oh, and my game crashed. <laughs>